Hello, this is Ayman Omar and uh, going to talk to you from Tokyo about some of the latest technology that has been developed in Japan. So recently, the Japanese telecommunication company NTT Docomo has introduced its uh, latest development technology using the 5G communication system. So what actually 5G communication system can do? So let's find out. The 5G telecommunication system will have a great impact in the communication uh, technology so it can transfer like uh, real time presence as you can see like you can be present in somewhere else in 3D so it's almost you can be somewhere else not of course uh, imaginary but nothing but also you can be like physically around in somewhere else using this kind, of, this kind of technology and this is what we can see in this kind of robot this is Toyota partner robot a new type of advanced humanoid robot which can move exactly like a human very flexible movement and can be controlled by an operator and the advantage of using a 5G communication system that to make it very smooth and very advanced control so this operator is being uh, placed 10 kilometers away from the site and he could control the robot in real time so let's see like what is the advantage of using a 5G communication system the robot now is going to show us his capability so he's uh, to show us how he can move so he's stretching his muscles to show us his uh, ability in using like movement in real time controlled by the operator which is uh, placed 10 kilometers away from the site so he seems to be very exciting about what he can do So the first task that given to the robot that he has to hold a very soft material which is a ball so the operator which is placed 10 kilometers away can easily hold the ball manipulate it and feel its softness and he also like have a camera the cameras of the robot can transfer the image in real time to the operator And also, like uh, the operator can manipulate objects in a very easy way. So, almost like you can see that the robot can move in real time. Such kind of technology can have a great advantage in the near future. We can use such kind of robots for uh, any kind of uh, dangerous scenarios. Like uh, we can send the robot to like a nuclear site or a disaster area. And he could be able to do some kind of task that the human have to do. So instead of sending a human, we can just send the robot. He can make some kind of repairs or 
maybe he can like uh, connect connect some kind of a power line power supply so and also he can go and rescue some human in the area where we cannot send real people which could be a very great advantage The operator is wearing an SCAT skeleton in his arm so to detect the movement of his uh, arms and hand so whenever like he make a movement that movement will be saved and be transferred to the robot hand to the robot arm so actually it's uh, when a kind of motion is detected on the arm of the user it could be transferred to the robot and in the other hand any kind of force applied to the arms of the robot will be transferred back to the user so the user or the operator could easily feel what the robot arm could have so this is an advantage in case that vision is not applicable the operator can easily manipulate any kind of object only by feeling the force feedback from the robot This advantage of using a 5G communication system so without this kind of uh, advanced technology or fast communication system we will not be able like to make this kind of uh, operation of a robot in real time so the user can be somewhere else far away and he could be able to perform some task have a real time feedback system from vision and also force feedback so this is uh, a cooperation between NTT Docomo and Toyota. It was a pleasure for me to make this robot. So I hope you have enjoyed this video and hope to see you again in another video. Goodbye.